craziest bastards I've ever met in my life. I love everyone. Crazy bastards, back for Sons of Wrestling, and tonight, uh, go over to the Sons of Wrestling t-shirt store. The merch link is in the description. Get the Decay shirt. Awesome stuff. $14.99 free shipping. Yes. And tonight we had a pretty goddamn good impact. We had a title change. We had a hardcore war, which was an awesome match. And uh, we just had a lot of good stuff going on. And good shit. And I really like the EC3 video. And that was really cool. And he's coming for Matt Hardy. And, uh, and now he's super Ethan. Uh, the old Ethan's retired, and yes, Babyface EC3 will be coming to TNA. So this is all good stuff. You had the miracle. We had Maria. Yeah, <laughs> always good. And uh, anyway, moving on. Let's get started. Matt, Rebby, and Tyrus come down to the ring talking about how uh, Matt's not in Jeff's shadow and the things that happen to Matt are to Jeff is yeah, that's his own deal and Matt is better than Jeff Hardy and this and that anyway comes down to EY and Brad coming out you know EY took out Jeff Hardy for him we are going to the UK every year this seems to be a thing and Jeff Hardy delivers a killer every year killer looking just taking the biggest shittiest bump to look like he's injured for a very long time. Look, look at last year. James Storm knocked him off the top of that cage down to this. Yeah, that was a crazy bump. And that's why Jeff Hardy is so goddamn great. He does things. He's evil Knievel in the ring. And he's just awesome outside of the ring as well. Very creative. And then, uh, well, EY thinks that that title, the TNA world title, goes through him from now on. And then Kurt Angle comes out. And, uh, well, he talked to some TNA officials. He has a title match tonight against Matt Hardy on his uh, farewell tour. So this is pretty cool. And then, uh, well, it looks like their talk, Matt Hardy gets a little cocky. Well, there's like five of us. There's only one of you. Beer money comes up back to Kurt Angle. So, hell yeah. That's pretty goddamn good. And, uh, well, we get a little brawl started going on here. And then you got the Decay come out. The Wolves join in. And we just, just chaos. And. And uh, this leads into later on, you're going to have a hardcore war with the Wolves, Beer Money, and Decay, and uh, EY Bram. So that was an awesome match. Next up, we got Lashley versus Aiden O'Shea. Raquel comes out. And uh, Aiden O'Shea, let me tell you what, that guy ain't no joke in the ring. And I really like the new gimmick that he's got going on. And uh, doesn't pick up the win here, but hey, because... Pleasures in the mind of Lashley. And he spears O'Shea for the victory. And Raquel says she could be pleasure or pain, this and that. So we'll see what happens there. And we got uh, confusion in Lashley's eyes. Yeah, lust. The confusion of lust. <laughs> then Maria comes out, says the knockout division's broken. And uh, she's there to probably try to fix it. And out with the old, in with the new, this and that. Yell Kim comes on out. And she says, if you want to fix it, go ahead and start right now. And it turns into a little physicality there. And Gal's ready to just pound the shit out of her. And come on, Maria, bring it on. Maria leaves. Looks like they're setting up Maria Canellas for a match against yeah, whoever, starting at the bottom maybe or right to the top. We'll see what happens. No spoilers, people. I don't know. I don't read the TNA spoilers because they do take in advance and people shit all over that but come on Lucia Underground's a whole season ahead so you can only shit on a company so much before you're yeah don't even then we got the Wolves and Beer Money versus EUI and Bram D and the Decay like I said awesome match just chaos chaos and in the end hell yes Rosemary comes out dragging those belts those belts come into play and yeah we get the mist sprayed into the face of um, was it Eddie Edwards or Davy Richards? Can't remember, but hell yeah, pick up the wick, the victory, the decay. Now my only complaint is Abyss needs to change the gear up a little bit. A new mask, it's really all just different. A new shirt, it's different. Just change it up a little bit because this was his old stuff. So time to change it up, man. Do that. Then we got Tyrus versus Galloway. And, you know, this could be a pretty goddamn good match, but Mike Bennett says, fuck it, he uh, 
tax drew with the briefcase, put the big dent in it, and uh, I guess the miracle is home, and it looks like that's where he's going to start, going against Drew Galloway, and I can't wait to see Mike Bennett in the ring against anyone on the TNA roster, so it should be a pretty good time. Then we got the X Division Championship, Tigre Uno versus Hurricane Helms, yes, Gregory Shane Helms comes out, but nope. It's not going to be him. He puts in Trevor Lee from Global Force Wrestling, from Omega Wrestling. And Trevor Lee, we seen him already earlier this year with the tag division. Him and Brian Myers picked up the tag championships and picks up the win here. And T. Ono definitely needs a break with that shoulder. He looks to be injured pretty good. And Trevor Lee, excellent. EC3, like I said, talk. He's coming for Hardy. That's awesome. And then. Kurt Angle versus Matt Hardy. Can you go wrong? And of course, Matt Hardy wins. Heel, tactics galore. Tyrus and Rebby, all the distractions in the world. And Kurt Angle's running the whole show. Hits that uh, twist of fate off the ropes and picks up the win. Matt Hardy, still your TNA champion. And uh, Kurt Angle's still not done. Farewell tour, moves to the UK. Coming up in UK tour, always phenomenal. That crowd over there, I love the UK crowd. So guys, what did you guys think of TNA? Leave a comment down here, and I wanna know some of your opinions on what are you looking forward to, and who, um, yeah, what was your favorite match? I think I'm gonna put together another show on top of this review into just uh, what's gonna happen preview for next week with all of your guys' opinions and uh, thoughts. So I think that should be pretty fun. Like I said, tomorrow night is the end of free shipping in the merch link down below. Get this cool new Decay shirt. Rosemary favorited it on Twitter, so it's approved. <laughs> so guys, it was fun. Leave your comments, thoughts, and uh, hit the thumbs up if you want to. It's much appreciated.